So this would be one of those times when I question if this is the smartest decision. This door is gonna get shoved open, hopefully. He's in there. I'm gonna back up as far as I can. I don't wanna get hit. Four, three, two. Whoa, the door Open. opens. Come on out, chickies. I've never been outside before. Not here, anyway. Come on. Okay. We can go out here now. Grab some uh, scratch. I'll throw scratch down. Take that to the front so we can close the front gate up there. And I'll just walk from the front again and we'll face them out. Do they work? Yeah. yeah. Those chickens are excited. Coming slowly. These are some spoiled chickens. So, we got our chicken run established, and they will go in and out as they please. Okay, so now we've got it done. So this is the whole chicken run, which is pretty big, but we got most of it done. So now we gotta rake out their cages, because it is gross. But... These are some spoiled chickens. Okay, so right now we're trying to get a ton of projects done. Uh, yes, it's not cold anymore, it's sunny. So we're trying to get this set up for our hanging rabbit cages for Panda and Houdini. Then we're gonna build a giant rabbit run of some sort for Lily, Brownie, and Bertha. But we've gotten all this set up. Now all we gotta do is just fill in these gaps, like right here. So then we can put a vapor barrier in it, and that will hopefully help them keep a bit warmer so it's not as bad. So right now what we're trying to do is we're trying to get this door framed in so we can put these on. And those will help and we're getting close to finishing this with the exterior. The interior is going to take a while, but it'll be worth it in the end. So this is how this is going. Uh, we got these doors from picking up some wood at some guy's house. Uh, they're saloon doors, so we're trying to remake them into a working door. But we're getting close to done with this and outside. Hopefully we have enough daylight to finish it. And if we don't, then we'll have to try and do it on Monday. 
Okay, so right now I'm trying to hold the spiggle roll, but we're trying to put up a vapor barrier around this building so there won't be a lot of moisture in it. So we still got to go down the rest of the side and then we'll be done. Okay, so we've now got this all around the building. Right, right now we're going to try and put some more 2x4s right there. And then we're going to move the latches and hopefully we can get the doors to start working. But we got about one more layer that we got to do probably up top and that will finish it off. But at least it's working and at least everything's working out great. Hopefully that's how it all goes. So our larger flock of chickens now has their own chicken run so they can come out. They were newer chickens so they had to be closed in for seven days um, so they would figure out where their home is because chickens are kind of stupid. So you can see the other chicken house over there. Um, and for now the chickens will be kept separate. Um, just until we know what we're doing <laughs> with them all. Um, we just have some temporary things going on for now. But they look good. And we get lots of eggs. Okay, so right now we're trying to build a composter because we need to clean out our chicken coops. So, all this is is five pallets, well, four so far, but five pallets screwed together, and then we'll just stack stuff here, and eventually we'll have dirt. So, we've been finding pallets and things for free, free wood, and things like that. Um... And now we can, we are going to go pick up some bigger pallets tonight um, to hopefully get the rest of our animal stuff done. We've got to build our above ground rabbit colony area tomorrow. So all of this wood will help us get that done. And uh, hopefully then our rabbits will have a home. It's warmed up finally from this polar vortex. So then they can live outside and be good to go. So this would be one of those times when I question if this is the smartest decision. There's still this sack of pallets over here that we were supposed to take. That's gonna have to be another trip, I think. But we gotta figure out how to get these home.